sure. Uh, it's been great working with Cameron Ward. Um, he's a great quarterback. You know, uh, I'm just trying to build the chemistry now. So um, when, when the season comes, it's just natural. What about him stands out to you the most in this first season? Uh, I would say, you know, just his ability to see defenses, uh, look at misses, uh, you know, being, being able to make a, a change, a different call on the read, uh, that's really uh, a huge step that stood out to me. Talk about your game this spring. Um, your name's been mentioned a few times. It's about it's making progress. How, how do you feel you're doing out there? Uh, I got work to do. I got a good thing to do. You know, I just wanna, uh, want my coaches to be able to trust me in any packages that I'm out there on the field, uh, my teammates for sure. Um, and I just got to keep working, keep growing. You know, I can never be consistent, never be comfortable. Um, and I'm always trying to get better. So do you feel you are making a move? Yes, I am. I'm making progress, but, you know, I still got a lot of improvement, you know, with these hands. Always. I can always enhance my craft. Always. Have you ever seen this off season? Um, well, I have a trainer I work out with back home. We do sprints. We work on hills. Uh, we have sleds with the weight on my back, you know, just some stuff like that. Do you get, like, GPS data? Yeah. Or, like, yeah, we, we, yeah, we, yeah we, we, faster than it's been? Um, I'm like a 21, high 21 guy, 20, low 22 guy. Have you been that before this offseason? Nah, last year I was probably like a, I was like middle 20. So yeah, I've been pretty much like Isaiah, what's some of your, your characteristics you want the fans to notice from you this year? Uh, you know, just, I'm, I'm a team player. I do whatever for the team, you know. I just want the team to, I want, I want us to win as a team. I want us all to be successful. When we're, one person eats us, I want us all to be, you know, so. Just do my do my best to make sure we all uh, miss each other. Some good battles with the new defenses so far that we've seen. This. How's it been going up against the Yeah, sir. Derek Poe is a great good defense of that. You know, uh, he great, gives me great battles every day. Uh, I appreciate him. Uh, Jay Rich, the guy from the city, he's a great dude as well. And I'm um, like like the saying is, iron sharp is iron. You know, we give each other better each and every day. What do you feel like is your toughest matchup? Um, all the DBs. I mean, I feel like they're all good. You know, I can't really pick and choose between one. They all have their, they all have their own style of play, and it's, hard, it's very good. But um, I only go against Daryl a lot, so I mean, Daryl gives me great work every day. There's some good young talent in your For room. Sure. With Trader, what stands out to you about his skills? He's just so natural. He came in so natural. He looks like he's been here before. He, he's he's going to be a great player for us. We're going to need him um, tremendously. I'm impressed with him as well. But like we knew this about him. You know, that's what he does. And he came in with a good head on his shoulder. He came in ready to. He's a team player as well. Also. So last year was like you know a flash here, a flash there from you. Um, I guess this year you're looking more consistent, more consistency and the capability maybe to make more plays week after week after week. Right, yeah. Last year you guys saw a little glimpse in Texas and them game, but yeah, this year I'm just working on my consistency, being it so my coaches can trust me, uh, make that play. They know I'm going to go make that play happen. Um, and just I need to I need to gain the trust from my teammates as well. As well. Speaking of trust, I, I, I heard you say you're trusting the process with everything that's going on. Has that process been going the way that you expected it to? I mean, yeah, process been going real well. You know, um, you never know how the process is going to go. It's the process, so you can't really like you, you, you always have an, a, a way you want it to go, but it's going to always knock you off. But it's just like that's what tests you the most. If, when adversity comes, how, how do you handle it? You know, so I, I feel like I handle it pretty well. What have you learned from the most from Xavier Restrepo and Jacoby George uh, within the past year or so? Uh, what I've learned from those guys, they, they taught me a lot, especially Xavier, and you know, just consistency. Um, I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna keep harping on that because that's that's really the big key, being able, being able to be trustworthy, um, and also being quarterback friendly. You know, you want to be quarterback friendly because those 50 50 balls I need to come down with, and it's just like as long as you're quarterback friendly, that's it, that's all you need. Thanks, Thanks. 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 Thanks.